something interesting here. Why are they putting these trucks in that situation? They are, I think, they are celebrating or focusing on. We are going to make a turn and I show you something that attracted my attention. This is a driving school. So here, they put all the trucks with an angle, with an angle with the rails. They left them, I think, overnight. When they came here, they did the same thing on this side. The trucks are angled with the ground. That means when the students come back to the classes, to the truck and the school class, each body will have a truck at an angle. And they have to put the truck back in a, between the two straight lines. We call it angled backing. Of course, when you are a student, that is a lot of angle. If the whole idea here in trucking, you don't learn how to drive a truck for sure, for almost two or three years to, to become good at it. But in the beginning, the only thing you need to do here at the beginning is to get the student, the students to get used to look at how big the truck is. This, even my truck is not that big. This is the day cab. But this is a super, this is day cab also. Even. This is a super cab. The other one next to it. And the other one is super cab. That is super. Okay. So that is a huge truck. So you get the student to get used to the atmosphere. Everything is going to be very big, very tall behind you. Like imagine you driving a truck as big as your own home. You are sitting in a kitchen and driving your own home in a highway. That's how big the truck is. Look at the mirror. This mirror takes too long to scan. If you look at this mirror, this is my left mirror, you can scan it quick. Look at that, if I have to turn my neck, I have to turn my neck that far here, and I have to turn it, look back to the front, remember that. So the mirrors have certain time scan, rate of scanning. Your left side, you can scan this too quick. But to turn your neck here, you can get injured in your neck, and you need to come back quick to the front because you are responsible for the, for the front. So how fast can you do it? You do it like this, quick, and you come back. But if you go here quick, look at that. Your shoulder, you have to turn your shoulder and neck and lower back to, to lower this, to see that vision and make a determination and on the top and on the side and on the front. Here is easy. Of course, you don't have a, a mirror in the middle of the windshield because you don't have anything to see behind you. That is angled backing. Uh, the reason the angle is very small, this angle will take you a while to figure out how the a combination make an angle. But where, where the tandem goes, where the front goes. Here you see they block the middle of the name of the cone. They block it here. If you look at this situation, they plug it here, so you are forced to exit and enter in a curve with an angle. 